Hey guys, um, I am back and I am going to show you guys a little something different. Uh, I'm going to be um, kind of reviewing a town for you guys that's somewhat popular for iron stuff, I guess. Um, now, the fun part about this is that I'm going to join a least populated server and um, hope that no one's there. So, and if someone is, we're just going to have to kill them probably. So, let's join US4. Alright, sure. Possibilities of, uh, possibilities of anyone being here is really low, so. Alright. So, do I have any instant health ones? No. Alright. So, um, welcome to Camp Azara. Um, I should probably tell you the coordinates, so I am going to, what should I do? I'm going to go down here, probably. Um, basically what this is, I'll explain while going down, um, what this is. This is, um a huge mountain or volcano I, I guess it's a mountain because there's no lava in the middle of it um it's a huge mountain with um with some stuff at the top and you you could go through the thing but actually it could be a volcano because there is lava in the center just not an active volcano all right so i'm gonna pull up the coordinates real quick you guys tell me if anyone's gonna be down there which there shouldn't be because there's three people Let's just scare one of them. Uh, oh, what's his name? Oh, my God. Nope. Alright. How is no one... It's Coco. Coco down there. Alright, so maybe I'll just type it out. Soup. Oh, it's a slash... Uh, slash message. Message. You, I don't have permission. Permission. All right. Um, in that case, uh, yeah. Let me just quickly pull up these coordinates. If they'd pull up really fast, that'd be great. Is that a name? All right. So while this thing loads, because it's taking a while to load, I just turned on my computer, so it takes a little while. Um, it's it's basically the gravel lands are over there. Um, south is there. North is up there. Um. This is actually like right over there is um what's the name of that town Portsmouth um over there over there would be the giants camp or giants spawn down in the valley thing because this is like the valley canyon kind of thing um what else I don't know um like I said I'll just show you this down here I don't know why it's taking so long to load my computer is just not wanting to work today. It's a Friday. I don't blame it, but oh. Alright. So the typical way you climb up this mountain is you go you'll down at the bottom there'll be like a sup. Um there are holes in the bridge, but I particularly don't climb up this way because this is the part that confuses me whether it's a volcano or not. Alright. Um and that up there is the town or whatever. Um so yeah this is a kinda difficult it's not difficult, it's just the pressure could kill you. Um, from being like, oh god, am I going to make it, am I not going to make it, um, somewhat difficult from that side or from this side, if you jump from that side, you'll probably land on the train, tra train tracks if you miss, or you'll land all the way down there, um, right there, like that little gray thing that you may see, um, now if you run from this side, you'll just run straight up into lava, or, or unless if you get onto there, the only way to probably get up is a lot of splash potions, or drink potions I guess and um a grapple that same life um and he died um so yeah that's that's basically it um oh one more thing I wanna go down just yet cause I need a little bit more food to go yeah I just need a little bit more food um I need a little bit more food to go up um really don't wanna try the jump you know what? I'll do it for the YouTube. Ready? We're going to do it right here. All right. We made it. Yay. Good. All right. So, um, the bad thing is when I go across. Um, that's a good place to hold down, actually. If you want to go with your friends in there and just be like, ah, oh, these guys are chasing us. Let's just, let's just kill them. But you just hold off that part with arrows and all that. Um, and here there's a military rare chest, I believe. Um, you need a button to get in there. I'm not sure if there's a button to get out. Uh, 
believe there is. I can't really tell you guys. Um, all right, and this is this is the part that messes a lot of people up. They're like, all right, they just step back, and if you sprint, it's gonna stop you. Oh my god! <laughs> all right, we're gonna do it again. All right, I'm ready. All right, good, we made it. Um, so yeah, this campus are like I said before, and it looks so nice at night time. Looks pretty. All right, now you guys must be wondering. Oh yeah, so you said you don't go up that way. No, I don't. What I do is I go around the mountain. I parkour around the mountain. This I feel like it's a safer way in a way. If you don't, if you're terrible at parkour, surprisingly, I made that for this video because um, the pressure was on and I just clutched up. Um, so what what I do is I go around the mountain. I parkour around the mountain. I know it sounds dangerous. Uh, like the most farthest you'll drop at a time is probably three blocks and server lags. By the way. A little bit. Oh boy, this isn't good. Oh, died. Oh, I just totally. Yep. Oh my gosh, how did I do that? All right. Uh, craziness. <laughs> um, so up here now we got we got the food chest. I just had to give it time to respawn because I knew you guys would be like, oh, food chests. Where are they? Um, we got the food chest in there. We got another food chest over here. I'm actually not gonna eat that apple because I don't have. I'm not hungry enough to eat that apple. I don't want any mushrooms, thank you. I don't want mushrooms. Dude, I am I think I should drink a potion, honestly. I'm probably gonna have to. Um, alright, so there's arrows, armor there. Iron armor usually spawns in here, bows, swords. Um, nothing for my use right now because I'm trying to get full iron armor to fight a giant. Um water source, very important. As you see, my throat feels a little bit quenched or a bit quenched. Um this is basically the place that you could literally hold off for years in a zombie apocalypse. Um, personally, grenades. For all you crazy people out there that love your grenades. Um, yeah, dude, I literally, this is all the stuff from this town. Except for the sugar. That's just from somewhere else. I think it's from Sundawn Observatory. Alright, so... Uh, where, what did I just take out? I really don't know what to do. Oh, I just put the green in. Anyways. Oh, oh bleh, bleh. Back up. Alright. Dude, I really want to pull up these coordinates. I knew I, 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 knew I said I was going to do it like a while ago. Alright. So, the coordinates for Camp Azara, which is in the gravel lands, or in the canyon for the gravel lands, is, um, as we wait. Dude, I am so sorry. My computer just loves taking a dump on me <laughs> and I'm recording the frames drop all right one cool thing I'll show you in the meanwhile is that if you go up these vines I mean you just want to be like hey guys look at me you stand there you do that you do your fancy stuff and this used to be open um, I'm not sure if they still put picks in this game because I haven't played mine Z in probably about six months six to seven months come on break all right good ah oh, you can't do that all right let me try again Alright, the map has loaded, so I'll be able to tell you in a second what the chords are. Um, I feel like I should have started out with that, but whatever. Blech. Come on. Oh, oh, oh. oh Alright, so either way, there's lava in there, whatever. It's just a house. Or you could just stand up here and be like, guys! Um, now, that's all the pro stuff, or the good stuff about this town. Um, two chests. One, two, three chests. Four chests right there. Five chest if you have a button um with armor and all that the downside i need to get down because <laughs> i just don't want to get shot off um the downsides about um camp bizarre though like i'm gonna tell you right it's chords right now um it's chords are x if you look f3 and you go like that or like that um it's this x that's z down there um she'll be able to probably see if i press E, alright, that's E. Y doesn't really matter because that's how high you are or low you are, your altitude or elevation. Um, I hope I use the right words because I don't know. I hope you like my skin too. It looks, it looks nice. Alright. Um, so the X is 1390, which is that, like I just said, 1390. I'm close enough. I'm actually going to go to those exact chords. Alright, it's, it's this way. 90. Alright, and then at Z is negative 2,000, negative 2,015, so basically its chords are right, 
top here. They don't bother putting the Y because it doesn't really matter. Um, you should basically you should basically see the object when you get here or wherever you're going. Um, all right, what was I gonna say? Oh, the bad things about this. Um, bad things are uh, like most other um, places in the north, pigment spawn. Um, like I said not too long ago, I I haven't played mine Z in a while because XP is kind of low. Even though I just got three X oh, one XP for a zombie kill, um, which are pretty hard to kill. Um, the the um, the pigmen are very strong. I think the big ones explode into little zombies. You get blast damage, I think, from the big ones. Um, they explode into little zombies. Uh, and then the little zombies are just really fast and annoying and, you know. Um, so you want to avoid those. Um, also, they they spawn in the small pigmen, which are, like, fast as the small zombies. But those pigmen just explode. I could count, like, a bunch of times that I, I was on the edge and a pigmen just pops out of nowhere. I hit it and I just go flying off the mountain. Um... Also, this is, uh, I'll show you guys a really good place to log out. Oh my god, my shots are off right now. Um, I'll show you guys a really good place to log out to avoid bandits. Of course you move when I fire. Um, to avoid bandits um, when you log out, because when you log back in, um, you really don't want to be in the middle, like right over there in that house, because they'll just totally just kill you. Yeah. So, yeah. That's a food chest. Those are military stuff. This is military stuff as well. Um, now, this is the place that you log out. You do slash log out. 15 second uh, thing. So you can't run away from people and just totally just disconnect. Um, like I was saying, zombie spawn rate is medium to low. There's seven chests, which I showed you. Um, there are no graves. Um, and now, finally, the biggest risk of all, if you watch The Walking Dead or whatever, or just a basic zombie lover, not saying I am, but, um, bandits, uh, yeah, you just don't want to be around them, uh, especially large clans of them. Um, and now, saying that you're, now looking at it, or what am I saying? Um... Since you are in their territory, which is the gravel lands down here, PvP fights and all that, uh, Elium is over there. I'm um, probably gonna review that next. Um, since you are here in their place and their town, it's better to log on to at least populated server, um, like I have. Probably about nine other people, eight other people instead of myself. Um, you wanna, you just don't wanna get caught up in all that, you know. Get your iron, do your stuff, get a couple of friends. One, two, three, four. And then log out, go up, or change servers, hop if you want to. It's not bannable like every other thing in Annihilation. Um, and basically kill the the people and all that. It should be pretty fun. Um, yeah, that's. I mean, that's the only way I could look at killing bandits. But except, not except, but aside from that, guys, I, I'm tripping up on all my words, literally. Besides from that, I think this is... I'd probably rate this place... Probably... I don't know. Probably an 8 out of 10. Because it lost its 2 points from all the, the bandits and and the pigmen. And the height that if you were to fall, you'd die immediately. Um, so yeah, that's what I would rate it. Uh, I'm going to see if there's any more loot. Just to show you guys, probably not, because you have to be like 10 blocks away. And of course, it despawns when I just need food. Alright, thanks so much for watching. This has been a review on Elium. Um, once again, the chords, I'll say it one more time, are uh, X is 1390, Z is 2215. Alright, thanks so much for watching, and I'll see you all later. Looks like a container and cell. Like, hello? Anybody there? Anybody in the camera? Anyways, I'll talk to you guys later. Um, yeah. Bye.